Kia ora, welcome to my happy place. If you like today's video, please give me a thumbs up, leave a comment so I know that you've been, don't be shy, and please enjoy. Right, I have come, I have come on to do a um, prompt from Wooly Steph and it's WS Art Club. Hashtag WS Art Club. Um, we made these little wee journals and we're going to be doing a prompt every second week. And um, I'm really quite pleased with how my um, little journal worked out. I just used um, a thick craft card and tied it in with ribbon. I put little notches in it to hold the ribbon in, but it didn't work so well, so I glued them. So I'm really quite pleased with that. So that is my little journal. And we're going to be working on little cards and glue them in. Right, I put a little bit of black around it so you can see it. And the first prompt is summer. Ironic, because we're going into winter, winter but never mind. Um... Going to first what summer means to me. Well, it, in summer we are always at the lake, and the lake is blue skies and um, blue skies and dragonflies. I love my dragonflies, so. And try and get a nice mix of colours on here. Mixed media is my my favourite thing to do, but I also like collage and lots of other things. So I'll take that down a bit. Want it to be too blue. Just going to put a little bit of white in with it. Take this. All right. Might have to get some more paint out. All right. Going to come down a little bit. Get a bit more white in it. Start up. So I'm quite looking forward to doing these prompts. Nice little change to be working just in small small um On a small canvas rather than a, a really big one. Right, I think I need a little bit more of that darker blue. It's just about run out that one. My husband's out in the shed rearranging his shed. I've been inside this morning trying to rearrange my um, craft room and get rid of some junk that always seems to be there but not be used. All right. Try and get a little bit more white in that, but not too much. A few sort of cloudy bits and down the bottom here we just want to smooth it up a bit get it a little bit lighter like it might be water all right i'm going to dry that off and then i'll be back Right, I'm back. 
and I'm going to see if I can just give it a little bit of a horizon mark here. Hmm. I'm quite happy with that. Oops. I can't see all that well in the um, screen. My eyesight's not that great at the moment. Um, but that's what it's looking like. So I'm going to give that another little bit of a dry off. Right, we're back. And now I have a piece of collage I'm going to put on here. Because another thing that is summer in New Zealand is picnicking whoops picnicking in Pahutakawa trees and there's no way I can draw one of those so I'm going to put that like that that's going to go there like that like that and I might just have to get my brush And just try and make our sky in here just a little bit bluer. Yep, I'm okay with that. Right, I have got a blue... Um, ink over here that I'm just going to go around the edge of that there just to take the, the white off right. and get some glue right let's see if I can get any glue out of this it comes out of here quite easy that's good I'm suffering with arthritis in my thumb and it's giving me a bit of jip at the moment. To say it sucks getting older. Right. Just take this to the side and give it a wipe around here. Right, I'm just going to wipe that off the paper and see what we can do here. Right on the edge, and I cut it a bit short, which was very frustrating. But never mind, we will get that sorted. Whoops, stop moving it, just wipe my hands. Right now, just get in here. And I hope I'm in shot. Right, just move that back down to the edge. Hmm. I like that. Right, we're a little bit over at the edge here at the top. I knew we would be. Just trim that off. Right, quite like that. That still needs just a little bit of a more definite Oh, I quite like that. It's coming on nicely right now. I have got a little wee trunk of a tree here that I hopefully is going to just go off the edge of the page there just to just to fill in that little gap. Oops. Terrible old lady shakes again today. 
it's very frustrating. Get it over, we don't want it. Okay, it's not perfect, but I'm okay with that. Right. I think I haven't cut that down enough there. Right now, now where is my lid? Put that back on before I just squirt it off everywhere. Right, I'm quite liking that. Now I have got here. Now they're going to be way out of um, proportion to the to the little scene, but I'm okay with that. Dragonflies here. Right now, take that off so I can see them. And I'm going to put them right there. Put some pressure on it. Awesome. Love that. Right. Back to the side. Now I've got another brush here. Just wipe the wet off it. And I have got here some Dragonfly Green Spray, which is just about to the end. But hopefully I'll get some mica out of it. If I can just my dragonfly wings a little bit of colour without botching it up too much. Lovely, lovely like that. See if I can get a little bit more of the micery bits out. To concentrate when I'm doing this so my hands don't shake. I'm really happy with that. Right, now where's my lid? Put that back on there. Wipe my hands and I'll just wipe, I uh, dry that off. Well, I hope I was in shock. to ink around the edge again hopefully give it just a darker edge to it right now, it'll... Oh, really like that right let's do that again that off there and not off there and I think we'll see if I can put a little dark edge around it as well. Right now I need a little Need a little um, tag saying summer somewhere there, but I'll be back. 
and back and I've got my little wee summer I did it off I did it um, off screen because my hands are so shaky it just um, took me a while to do it and get it cut up all right get some glue on it like that we don't want it to be too too gluey and I think I'm going to put it up here in the Pahutakawa tree slip you up whoops slip you up so you're a bit straighter not that my eyes see straight very well <laughs> right Right, just clean my hands off a bit and this is going to be my first page I quite like them just showing up on the on the craft so I'm going to stick it down with double-sided tape We're off back off to the lake again tomorrow for the weekend. It's Queen's birthday weekend. So oops. Don't want you to be over the edge, thank you very much. in the middle just to hold it down right That's my bone folder give it a good burnish and I think I'm gonna need my little knife to lift up the edges maybe This takes a little bit for me. You got the shaky hands and can't see very well. It's a bit of a mission. Oops, I stick on there. Pick you up. Alright, that is that. Open your book. And I like these books that can just lay down like that. Now, I'll just have to stand up here so that I get it relatively... I can't say that the pages are square. Um, but I want to get it relatively straight in there. Right, that... down is the first oh sorry that is the first page in my Willie Steve's Art Club prompts and I'm really quite happy with it now I suppose I should put the date on it shouldn't I would be a good idea out a new pen and the date today is let me see the 19th and we're going to put that I think I'm going to put it on the card down here the 19th of the fifth month 
into one. Right. I like that. I like that a lot. I'm very happy with that. And these are going to be a fortnightly um, prompt, I believe. And I will put Woolly Steph's um, channel in the show more for those that don't know her, but I'm pretty sure everybody does. Thank you for being with me. Kia kaha, stay strong, and I'll catch you again soon.